Hey guys! Okay, so sorry that this is the same look that I was wearing in, well, it will be yesterday's vlog, but I thought I would record two vlogs back to back so I didn't need to worry about missing so many days. So I'm going to do the Holly Jolly holiday tag. So let's get started. Favorite Christmas movie? That's a tough one for me. I'd say it's between White Christmas and The Grinch with Jim Carrey. So those are like some of my favorites. The White Christmas because it's like a classic with like Bing Crosby and I just, I love it and I've watched it ever since I was little. And then The Grinch because it's just really fun and Jim Carrey is amazing as The Grinch. And now with Carter, he loves to watch it too. Are you on the naughty or nice list? I would like to think that I am on the nice list. So I'm going to go with that. Have I ever had a white Christmas? Yes, many times. I live in the Northeast. Um, I'd probably say that the majority of my Christmases have been white Christmases, so that's nice. I can't picture not having snow or it being freezing cold on Christmas. I can't picture it that way. So that's, late. that's that. Have I ever... Oh, I wasn't reading the same one. Oh, I missed one. Show us an embarrassing Christmas card photo. I don't have one. Um, my family, like my mom and I, uh, never did Christmas cards really when I was little. And if we did, it was just kind of like you'd buy the card at the store and you'd write on it and then send it out. We didn't really do pictures, so I don't have one. I've only done them for Carter and I um, and sending them out. But um, when they come in, I'll show mine to you, but I don't have an embarrassing. I'm, I'm sure I would if we... Uh, if we did do them, I'm sure I would have an embarrassing one. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, where do I usually spend the holiday? Usually we spend it um, right around where I live. Um, sometimes we travel to some family, which is about 45 minutes away. Um, sometimes they come here. This year, um, everyone's coming to our house. So that'll be fun. Uh, play or sing my favorite Christmas song. Um, I'm going to attempt to sing. This is going to be humiliating. So I'd say that I feel like it's the most holiday-y, is that a word? Probably not, out when I hear this song. So, <clears throat> it's a holly jolly Christmas, it's the best time of the year. I don't know if there'll be snow, but have a cup of cheer. So that's the song. Hopefully you could understand what I was singing, and hopefully I got the lyrics right. So humiliating. <laughs> okay. Do I open any pres Christmas presents on cr bleh. Do I open any presents on Christmas Eve? Um, I don't know how long I have. I want to say since I was in kindergarten, I've opened like one small gift on Christmas Eve. Um, last With Carter, I started last year, because last year he really just got into it, uh, was starting to get into Christmas. I got him his own copy, his own version of The Night Before Christmas. Um, so that was his Christmas Eve present. This year, I'm going to start the tradition of on Christmas Eve, we open up, like, Christmas pajamas. So that's going to be his present this year. Um, let's see. Can I name all of Santa's reindeer? Rudolph. Okay, so Rudolph, Dasher, Dancer, Prancer, Vixen, Comet, Cupid, Donner, and Blitzen. I think that's how you know you have a kid. <laughs> Uh, what holiday tradition are you looking forward to most this year? Um, I don't know. Probably just having family over. It's just fun around the holidays, especially to have the house full and all the great smelling food and have the Christmas lights on and everyone around the tree and all the presents under it and just, you know, the talking. I love gatherings. Like, I love big gatherings. I'm someone who, like, I don't mind busy restaurants. I love stuff like that. Like, I love stuff going on. So... That's probably what I'm most excited for. Is our Christmas tree real or fake? I have always gotten a real one. Um, we've never gotten a fake one. I just love real Christmas trees. Um, I understand why you'd want a fake one. They're a lot easier. No mess. It's very nice. But I just, I like the tradition of going to get it and putting it on the car. And especially now with Carter, I want him to enjoy that. And um, I also just love the smell of it. It's worth the mess for me, so... Let's see. Hands down, what's my all-time favorite holiday food and holiday sweet treat? Holiday food. Um, 
I'd probably say scalloped potatoes, just because in my head that's what my grandmother's like always had made for Christmas, so I really relate it to Christmas. So I'd probably say that. And holiday sweet treat, that's a mix between those Italian rainbow cookies and uh, I forget what they're called. My aunt makes them every year. There's these like thick cookies with like a print of like jam in them, but they're not thumbprint cookies. I don't remember what they are. They have like a cherry and I don't remember. But they're really good. So it's probably a mix between those two. Be honest. Do you like giving gifts or receiving gifts? I love giving gifts. Like when you look back at home videos of me from when I was two, I wouldn't open my presents till my parents opened all theirs. Like I love giving gifts. I think that's what I get like most excited for around the presents aspect of Christmas because I love like making people happy and like seeing their reaction on their face when they get something that they were looking forward to. So I love giving presents. I mean, it's fun to get them too, of course, but I just love giving gifts. Show us your tackiest Christmas attire. Again, I don't really have one. I've never been one like to have like the ugly Christmas sweater. I mean, this is like a sweater, but I don't, I don't know. I don't personally think it's ugly, so I'm not going to show it as one. Um, but I don't really have one. I wear something different each year, so I wouldn't, I don't have one. Um, what's my dream place to visit for the holiday season? Like I said, I can't picture Christmas not being cold out. So if I had to pick, like, a dream place to go for Christmas, I'd probably pick, like, Aspen in Colorado. Like, that would probably be my dream. That's in Colorado, right? Oh, my God. Can you tell that I'm, like, fried? But, like, probably, like, Colorado in the mountains. So that would be, like, a nice place to go. Um, let's see. Does your family have a special holiday recipe you like to help make? Uh, I don't know. I mean, we're at a weird transition time right now where I'm starting to make my own kind of traditions. I like to do, like, making the Italian rainbow cookies each Christmas and stuff like that. Um, I just love baking in general. Just baking in general. Um, oh, what are those treats? They're, like, they have, like, the cracker and then, like, chocolate on it and, like, like, I want to say, like, toffee or something. Like, so good. Those are really good. So those are fun to make. I love making English toffee, though. I love it, and it's so easy and fun. So I like that. Are you a pro present wrapper, or do you fail miserably? I like to say that I'm a pro, but, you know, I'm not. But I definitely don't fail miserably. I've definitely tried over the years to perfect my wrapping. It depends what time of day I'm wrapping, and whether it's the first present I'm wrapping or the last present, because you can definitely tell which ones I started with and which ones I ended with. <laughs> Um, most memorable holiday moment? Probably the Christmas I was pregnant with Carter because that's the night that we announced uh, if we were having a boy or a girl to my whole family. So that was a really fun moment. We did that Christmas night because we found out like on the 19th or 20th of December. So we saved it for Christmas. So that was really fun. What made you realize the truth about Santa? Um, I noticed that Santa's handwriting was identical to my mom's handwriting. <laughs> so, but I still totally believe in Santa. Like, hello, like that's a, you know, the Christmas aspect of it's about, and it's just nice. Um, do you make New Year's resolutions and do you stick to them? I do make New Year's resolutions and I try my hardest to stick to them. Um, yeah. So I'll probably do a video closer to New Year's about like a New Year's resolution. What makes the holidays special for you? Honestly, just the feeling I get around the holidays. It's just a warm, cozy, exciting, loving time of year, and I just love that feeling. And especially now having Carter, I love being able to share that with him. So that's really fun. All right, so that is the Holly Jolly Holiday Tag, and I tag anyone to do it that sees this, and I hope you enjoy it, and I'll see you for tomorrow's vlog if I have time to make one.